Hello all you hardcore boxing fans out there, how are you doing? It's Big Porky here, the voice of hardcore boxing. Should Antonio Tarver be a first ballot Hall of Fame? Yeah, I think he should, because he fought in that era, didn't he? Glenn Johnson, Roy Jones, Dawson, Montel Griffiths, Griffin is it or Griffiths, Clinton Woods. He fought in a great era and he's got a great record. Olympic bronze 1996, 31, 6 and 1 record. 22 knockouts, southpaw, never been stopped. I just think that he should be a first ballot Hall of Fame. Looking at some of the people that are going Hall of Fame, he, he should be nailed on, shouldn't he? Olympic medalist and seven wins over world champions, former, current, and future. Seven. Same as Marvin Agler, or marvellous Marvin Agler. And Sugar Ray Leonard, Nigel Benz, seven wins over world champions. So he should be in the Hall of Fame. Right, but then again, Nigel Benn's not in the Hall of Fame, is he? So maybe I'm contradicting myself, but Nigel Benn's not got an Olympic medal, has he, like Tarver? And Tarver's record's a little bit better than Nigel Benn's, isn't it? I just think he, sh he should be nailed on for it. Uh, that's just my opinion. I think he's a great fighter. And I just don't think he gets as much respect out of the boxing community as some other people, you know, people who were probably more popular on social media or people who were in the right place at the right time or basically kiss asses. And I think Tarver's done it his own way, the magic man. And I just think that he should be a first ballot. It's coming up in the next couple of weeks. It's a five years since he's been out at ring. So I'd like to see him next year in Hall of Fame. All right, so peace out. Keep on trucking. Keep supporting boxing. Shout out to my pal Robin Reed's multivitamin business. <laughs> Bit cringe that in it, but gotta help your pals, aren't you? So peace out.